Hey guys, welcome back to another vlog. I have some shopping planned for the next few days, some spring shopping, if you will, and I'm very excited. A little mix of some downtown shopping and some thrifting. So I'm gonna bring you guys along with me. Going into spring, I'm really looking to revamp my wardrobe, get solid on my capsule wardrobe, and maybe find some new pieces that could be some really cute tops or pieces for this coming season. I'm also planning to do a spring cleaning video soon, so make sure to subscribe and stay tuned for when that video comes out whenever I'm bringing in new pieces I always want to get rid of and donate old pieces that I don't need or use anymore so as we're going shopping today we got to make sure that we're also cleaning out the old when we bring in the new I just got ready and I'm waiting for my friend Mariko to pick me up today we're doing a little girls shopping day downtown and I'm really excited specifically for Brandy Melville because we do this like annually where we'll go to Brandy Melville and just go ham in there whatever we buy during these trips to Brandy end up being such day Staples for us we end up wearing them so much and they become like staples in our wardrobe so that is my plan for today I'm so excited for brandy because it's been too long I'm wearing a little trench today because it is raining outside kind of on and off I'm gonna do my little misty or perfume I really like this roller and I like to put it on my wrist and then my neck she just texted me that she's here so I'm gonna show you guys my outfit before we go and meet her because she's in my driveway so I feel like this has kind of become my designated like rainy day outfit except for I have a couple new pieces that I'm like so excited about. This trench is from Abercrombie and it's seriously a staple in my wardrobe. I highly recommend and I will link it below. I'll link everything that I'm wearing below if you're interested. This white tee I wear all the time. It's from Aritzia by Wilfred Free. This belt is a new addition. It's from the brand Cezanne and I'm obsessed with leopard right now. I think this is such a cute little detail for your outfit. And I've also found recently the best black jeans. These ones are by Denim Forum by Aritzia and I'm obsessed with the fit. So so I will link them also below for you guys because I think they are so worth it. I even find better than Abercrombie and Levi's and all those other brands. I also have a couple things to return because I've been trying so many pairs of jeans recently and a lot of them haven't worked out. So I'm really happy to have found a pair that I love. So today I won't be looking for jeans. Although I am interested in finding a dark wash pair of jeans. Like a dark blue denim. And I've seen a couple people post about these ones by Dynamite. And maybe I'll try them on today. We'll see. We're just looking to go to a bunch of different stores downtown maybe even scout out some sephora sale items and then my bag i didn't mention my bag yet but this is from anthropology and it fits a lot of stuff i'm excited i can just like throw my camera in there today film everything for you guys and i also have my returns in there so that's perfect gonna head out and we'll see you guys downtown <laughs> We're in Dynamite right now and I'm trying to find these dark blue jeans and someone's trying to find them for me right now so hopefully I can try them on. Okay, here's the jeans. They're not amazing. They're a bit too long. Also, I think maybe I would need a 26. They're not as dark as I imagined or want so they're gonna be a no. Iconic nude. I'm trying to find a new lip liner. I'm gonna try what I, wherever Walnut by Makeup Forever as well. Ooh. Love Trap? They're really buttery. Why do I like this shade better? That's just too pink. This one's Love Trap and I kind of think I like it better. Those look so cute. Ooh. Looks... Ooh, it smells good. Ooh, it smells like caramelly or something. I fuck with that, I fuck with that. The one on the left Ooh, is I Wherever like Walnut. And the middle is Love Trap. I don't know which one I like better. I feel like they're so similar. And the one on the right is Iconic Nude, which I feel like I have some that are similar already. So that's the verdict. I'll be saving it for the sale. working with so far pair of shorts little tee tank top a couple tank tops we'll try it on and see we'll see how it goes cute lots of comfy tops we want comfy tops I'm sure it's a pinstripe and I think I like them better because the white ones are a little bit see-through because you do I even need another pair of shorts I mean they're so cute though they have a little pony so cute I'm 
I'm really torn about these right now because I don't know if I really need them. They're cute, but I'm being honest, I don't really think I need them. I think we're leaving them behind and then just going with little gray tee and then this V-neck, which I really liked as well. And that's pretty much it. shopping at Brandy and shopping at we checked out this like vintage store on Granville Street in Vancouver now we're at Valley Village like their boutique location in Granville Street and this is my first time here so we'll see how we do hi guys welcome to day two of this vlog where we go shopping for spring except today it's really not looking like spring at all it is so rainy and I'm going to meet up with my friend Michaela for some thrifting and a little coffee date first we're going to coffee it's like 1.40 right now now I ended up getting a really good haul of the things I got yesterday I really so badly want to show you guys what I got but I'm gonna hold off to do like a full haul at the end of this with everything that I get from thrifting brandy etc so I'm gonna hold off on that also my camera is balancing so lightly right now on my dashboard and she's holding off so well I am donating a bunch of things I have a bunch of things in the back and I have more to donate for my spring cleaning video I'm just gonna keep some things separate for later when I go I just missed my turn Oops. So I'm gonna keep some of that stuff to donate for my spring cleaning video and then obviously donate some stuff today as well So that'll be really good. I have like three bags of stuff. So I have a lot to donate Oh, okay. I didn't mess up too bad with where I turned actually But yeah, so that'll be good because like when you donate to value village you get like 20% off So I'm gonna get that coupon and then if I buy anything today I'm gonna use the 20% to buy myself some new stuff. So that'll be exciting I have a lot of like random stuff stuff to donate today like things that my mom wanted me to bring things that my brother wanted me to bring just a bunch of random stuff honestly okay I made it so I'm gonna park now found the prettiest gold watch that I've been really wanting. I've really been wanting a little gold watch to go with my jewelry and it's so cute. I just bought it, 20 bucks, and I'll do a full haul after today though. Okay guys, the finds, the finds, look at this cutie little vase, which you can't have too many. I'm a sucker for home stuff. I had to resist all of like the plates and the cute bowls because I'm not going to have any mattresses. <laughs> <interesting. laughs> but Slay 599 find. Got a cute tank. Got a cute, cute. cheetah find. We're into the cheetah print. Yep. And then we got a cute, cute, completely nude. I don't know what I'm going to do with this yet, but she has potential. So that's a Slay. That's a little... Very cute. I think my fave is this dress. Right? It's, it's so such cute. a good... And it was it's a little, little mini dress. It was in the top section too. It wasn't even in the dress section. Somebody thought this was a top, clearly, but yeah. for us, she's a mini dress. She's a mini dress. So good, success. been a few days and I have a haul of some things that I bought while I was shopping the past few days and I'm really excited to show you guys part of my spring wardrobe and some new pieces that I found that I think will be staples this spring summer for me so let's get into it I'm gonna start out with showing you guys the Brandy Millwell things that I bought when I was in store I'm pretty sure I showed you guys everything that I tried on in the change room interesting because two things I actually found later on and so many things that I tried on I didn't end up getting two things I found later on that ended up being ones that I got. First up, I got this basic kind of heathered gray t-shirt. It's not a super tight fitting t-shirt, but it fits me nicely. Just kind of like a basic tee would. It's not relaxed, it's not loose, but it's also not super tight fitting, which I really like about it. And it's also really soft. I wanted to get some really soft pieces that I could just wear like around the house, but also wear with like jeans and some sneakers if I want to go out too. Next up, I got this even softer long sleeve, also gray, a little more relaxed. The more I've been wearing it the past days, I've been realizing that it's a little bit more stretchy than I thought. Thought I could even wear it as a PJ top. I love these kind of tops for sleeping in, but I could also wear this with some jeans and sneakers as well, if you can picture. This is also kind of a heathered gray, and I'm not sure if it's showing up on camera, but really, really cute. Also, the tee was 25, and then so was the long sleeve. And then I got this really cute lace v-neck tank top. I really love Brandy's lace tanks. I have 
have one that's just a regular scoop neck but it's not ribbed like this it has like a little pattern so this is a little bit different this is my justification for me buying it i also wear my other one a lot also you know when you have white tops for a long time and you wear them a lot they start to kind of show that they've been worn a lot like in the armpits a little bit or they're just not as white as they used to be so that's another reason for me to buy another one so i can just have it in my rotation and you know eventually replace the ones that are just getting too worn i think i did pretty good at brandy i didn't go too overboard but also got a few good pieces and then at the thrift i got a couple different pieces from different places when i was downtown the first day i went to the valley village boutique that's on granville street in vancouver it's a new valley village location that's supposed to be a little bit more selected and curated and i really really liked it we didn't do like a huge deep dive but also i think i found some good pieces for just kind of skimming the store first i found this really cute white belt with this really cute gold detail Cezanne has a similar belt that i've been eyeing it's pretty much similar to the one that i was eyeing from Cezanne, and i really love it i think it looks super cute with jeans and i think it will go with every outfit that i have also love white and white bottoms for spring summer and i think a belt is such a great way to accessorize so i got that it was also like $8.99 i think and then i've been really into little turtleneck sleeveless tops lately and i found this really gorgeous deep red colored one and i feel like this is really cute for like a little dinner date with some dark jeans and maybe some booties really good material also has this little detailing right underneath the armpits it actually fits really nicely and like sucks you in it also has this little slit at the back so it kind of shows your lower back which i kind of love because it's kind of cute with jeans like you can wear jeans and then little slit there super cute and flattering so love this and then the second day at the thrift i went to a different valley village location this is the one that i usually will go to if i want to go thrifting and stay closer to my house i found this striped skirt it goes all the way to the ankle and it's really soft i didn't even realize till taking the tags off that it's actually garage when i was thrifting i didn't even look at the tag for some reason really cute really soft also fits really nice and i feel like this is a really cute beach cover-up but also just something cute to throw on for a little lunch with the girls in the summer with some sandals you can just throw on a little cute white top and then you're good to go with this skirt so really love this i've been super into skirts for spring summer so i'm building my skirt collection right now and i love this edition i think it was also four dollars and then i think this is the star of the show also it's kind of been sitting here so you've been able to see a little bit but look at this gorgeous leopard cheetah leopard this is definitely leopard leopard tote bag she has a long strap so you can wear it on your shoulder crossbody or just longer on the body or you can just throw it over your shoulder these also have clasps so you can like remove this if you want or you can just keep it inside the bag perfect condition it's also the brand Madewell, which is amazing and it was $16.99 so I think it's a steal such a cute accessory for outfits I love leopard right now I've been wanting some more fun bags because all my bags are like black and white and brown and I feel like I want some colorful bags and also some bags with a cute designer print to them so she's gorgeous and I love her my last find was this really gorgeous gold watch I have been seeing little gold watches all over Pinterest and I've been pinning them like crazy so I feel like I manifested her but look how gorgeous this is look how good this looks with all my other gold chains on my wrist I'm obsessed with how it looks it doesn't have a battery in it but either I will just use it no battery or I will go get a battery for it soon but I love it was also $20 really gorgeous and I'm honestly just looking to wear this just for like fashion purposes not so much to like actually read the time on it but yeah more as like a fashion piece also just like elevating my look a little bit more with some jewelry thank you guys so much for watching if you watched all the way to the end thank you so much i hope you enjoyed seeing my little shopping days and also my little haul because i had so much fun this week we'll be getting to some spring cleaning next week and i can't wait to share that video with you guys so stay tuned for that when it comes out make sure to subscribe if you aren't already subscribed thanks so much for watching and i love you so much bye